welcome to Helsinki. This week we are in the Finnish capital and we are going to be showing you some of the top attractions you should check out in the summertime. With its long days and short nights, summertime is a great time to be in Helsinki. This was our second visit to the Finnish capital and we were excited as ever to experience it for a couple of days. With summer in full swing, we enjoyed dinners al fresco, boat trips to nearby islands, and lots of walking around town. Here's a look at how we spent our time in Helsinki. One of our favorite things about being in Helsinki were all the street performances taking place. Esplanade Park hosted several concerts which were free to the public. So right now we're going to be visiting one of the most famous landmarks in all of Helsinki. This is Helsinki Cathedral and what's really cool about this church is that it's very different from other churches you find across Europe. Most European churches are very elaborate, they have a lot of paintings inside. However, once we go inside this church, you're going to see that it's very simple, very white, very clean, and it just looks like a blank canvas. Helsinki Cathedral overlooks Senate Square, so after you visit the church, you can sit down on the steps and watch people go by. Very exciting moment for me here in Helsinki. I'm an enormous Salmiaki fan, which is black salty licorice. It's extremely salty, and this particular kiosk here is famous because it sells over 91 different varieties of Salmiaki products. Okay, so what did you order from the kiosk? I got my favorite kind of salmiaki product, salmiaki ice cream. It's like the best of both worlds. It's very salty, it's very has a very strong licorice taste, and it's of course ice cream. Who doesn't like ice cream? And the coolest part here is that it's actually shaped like a salmiaki candy. It has that exact shape. So good. So what we're about to show you is called Dinner in the Sky and you're going to see some people sitting up on a table, just hanging from a crane. Look for yourself. Market Square is a great place to pick up fresh vegetables and berries. And you can also try a number of traditional Finnish dishes ranging from grilled salmon to reindeer meatballs. We frequented the market almost daily, and at 10 euros a meal, we thought it was a budget-friendly option for travelers. So it's now time for lunch and we've stopped off at Market Square, one of my favorite places to grab a really tasty and cheap meal. Today we are having grilled salmon with potatoes and vegetables. And yeah, let's go enjoy this before it gets too cold. Hungry boy, ready for the first bite? It's time for some salmon. Mm. I never get tired of eating salmon. If I lived here, I'd probably be eating this daily. So now that we're finished eating, we're going to show you the more crafty side of Market Square. This is a great place to pick up some traditional Finnish products and souvenirs to take back home. Helsinki has a thriving design district and I really enjoyed visiting various shops which showcase the best of Scandinavian design. My favorite of course was Marimekko which is renowned for its bold patterns and bright colors. So right now I'm in the Marimekko store which is one of the most famous design stores in all of Finland. Finland has a unique tradition where people come and wash their carpets on floating docks by the sea. The carpets are then left to dry overnight without fear of anyone stealing them. After washing your carpets, it's a great area where you can just go and grab a drink and relax. So 
Up next, we are visiting the Campi Chapel of Silence. This chapel is located in one of the busiest areas of Helsinki, and it's supposed to be a place where anyone can drop by and just enjoy a moment of silence. No services are held in this church, but they do have clergy and social workers on hand if anyone needs to speak with them. So Sam, do you think one day you'll be able to grow an impressive beard like Santa's? Never. It looks like peachy fuzz that I glued onto my face. Helsinki has a number of unique landmarks and attractions, one of them being this church carved out of a rock. And what's really cool about it is that this church has amazing acoustics, so it's actually a very popular concert hall. The roof consists of a copper dome surrounded by a skylight, which allows natural light to stream into the building. During one of our afternoons in Helsinki, we hopped aboard the Helsinki sightseeing cruise. The trip was an hour and a half in length and we got to see the various islands that make up the city's archipelago. It was a beautiful sunny day with blue skies and we saw a lot of sailboats out on the water. Day to be outdoors today and we are all geared up to go on a bike ride we are going to be taking the tour of Helsinki Really silly with your ball cap and a helmet on top. Come on, I'm starting a new fashion trend over here. This is what's considered cool these days. Oh, really? No, no, definitely not. But what is cool is that just getting outside of Helsinki a few kilometers and you're out right in the woods. This is amazing. Let's do 360. So we just finished our four hour long bike ride around Helsinki and next up we are going kayaking. Right now it's 9pm, still bright out and I think we're supposed to be back at midnight so let's go. Normally, I like to do a single kayak because I don't really trust them on the water, but I've been tapped into this double kayak for newlywed couples. Teamwork. Huh. Teamwork. Except I'm the only one paddling because you're sitting back there filming. Yeah, that's about right. Oh, the barrier. A few beers in the, in the back of the double kayak. Yeah, I'll just have the beers, sit back, and let her do all the work. Right, Audrey? Oh, hush. Paddle! Paddle faster! Okay. No! Don't make it wobble! I'm gonna tip it over! Wobble, 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 wobble! Sam, that is not Sam! Okay, so It is 11.30 now and we are paddling back home in the dark with nothing but the moon and our lights to guide us. This is a city that comes alive during the summer months and it was great enjoying all the events taking place in the city 
as well as relaxing outdoors. We loved revisiting Helsinki and we discovered so many new places that we had completely skipped over the first time around. Have you been to Helsinki? Let us know about your experiences in the comments below. For more travel and food videos, hit subscribe.